All right, we're gonna see if I could focus in, and if you guys can see, I'm, I'm putting the glasses there from far away so you guys can see. Uh, unfortunately, the focus is not letting me grab some of the focus stuff, but you could see some enlargement on there, and we're not using the largest magnification, we're just using a smaller version of it because I don't wanna uh, have the phone restrained too much because it won't work very well, but you can see the quality of it um, on the motherboard, it looks very well. Today we're going to bring another headband. This actually has a magnifying glass that we're going to take a look at it and see what you get. Also included, it has LED lights. Uh, we're going to take a look at the whole thing and see how well it works together. So and what is it used for? A lot of jewelers use this kind of system. Not only that, technicians, there are soldering engineers and stuff like that that require that they want to strengthen their eyes. This is a perfect way to actually use the actual hardware for so we're going to take a look at it and see what you get when you get something like this so let's go ahead and open it up so first of all they give you the actual instructions off the front all right how to handle the whole system how to actually install the actual lenses all right and then in case they give you the actual whole case of lenses in here and they give you quite a few all right and of course in the front of the actual box it tells you how many millimeters um per per glass you know they, they give you from 1x to actually 3.5x uh, very simple. Uh, you cannot combine these. There's only one by one, all right? So you got to have to find the magnification that you require in order to use, all right? You can double them, or like other systems, but you could use one at a time. And this is actually pretty good because it's a, it's a little lightweight too. They give you a little clean cloth, of course, and they give you the actual strap that goes around your head too, in case you, you don't want to drop them. Or you could just use it without the strap and they pretty much look like glasses. They, they lined up like glasses, but you have that option as an extra precautions if you don't want to break them too. Now, like I said, there's only one entry here in the back, and we're going to actually set one up. I'm going to get the first one, and look at these. They're like little mini shades already built in, ready to go, and you just pretty much set it up in here, clip it in there, and you're set. Now, this one, you cannot move left or right. It's only up and down. There's an LED light right in front of it, we get, this is the off and on button right here. All right, for the battery entrance, there's an extra entrance in the back here, and you're gonna need, require two AAA batteries in the back. So this is not a, a, a chargeable battery, so it's gonna require your regular batteries, two AAA batteries you put in the back. And you can just close the cover, cover itself. It has little clips in here. You just find the clips and clip them in there, and that's pretty much it. Now we're gonna set this up and see how well it looks, but first of all, let's fit it in, see how uh, fits on my on my nugget so if you guys notice i'm gonna get a little closer uh the this is adjustable so if you don't want to see the camera or anything else you can just adjust it uh, but legible stuff actually <laughs> it's really good I, I, i'm impressed with the actual quality of it just by looking at it i don't have to restrain my if i want to use them as reading glasses i can do that too as an option too so as the older you get you're probably going to require a larger magnification but for now if you're going to be working with miniature stuff uh clay figures or anything if you're, a ho if you're a hobbyist or anything like that if you're building model kits and painting little micro um, paints that you need to do this is a perfect way to do it and not only that you computer engineers are out there that are requiring to solder things very micro things that you need to solder this is a perfect way to do it uh doesn't have too much distractions other than the glasses right in front of you this is adjustable and it fits really well with my old glasses i don't you can't put your glasses over this you're gonna have to require to take off your glasses of course because it does take the, your nose your nose area here so this in, indentation actually fits as my glasses they're very comfortable if you guys can see so I like them very much. So we're gonna take a look at it, how they look from the actual, from an actual phone to something micro. So let's go ahead and do it. Uh, if you want, it's easy to clean these things. You don't have too much maintenance on them. Uh, if you guys can see the glasses, they fit really well. You could adjust them, even harden the actual screws to make it a little more, more or less flexible, but they feel very comfortable. They, just like I have Oakley's actually, and they feel like Oakley's. Um, and the batteries doesn't have any weights to it. It just, feels like natural because of your nose uh, area, rest area right here. And that's adjustable too. That's bendable and replaceable and removable too. So I like this part. Hope you guys enjoy the video. 99.6 of you are not subscribers in my channel. 
I hope that the content helps you out and that you find it very useful. And I hope you hit the like and subscribe.